Uh, my name is Jamie Taylor, and I will be, you know, today is December the 3rd, 2022, and I'll be talking about the eye dissection, um, the cow eye. Here is a kind of list of what I will have for my nose is the different things that I'm required to identify. Um, so I just want to know this will be what I'll have out. And then I'm going to lower this where we can hopefully see the eye a little bit better. This was a little bit of a messier one. Um, which some of it is still... I'm going to try to put this back together as we start going over this a little bit. Here we go. Flip her over. Okay. So, this was the eye. Um, and here we have the cornea. And then the white part of the eye um, would be the sclera. And so when I cut into this, um, we had the two different cavities. Ooh, this is a little bit juicy. Okay, and um, this is the this is the anterior cavity. And here's the posterior cavity. So let's look first here at the posterior cavity. Um, the posterior cavity was filled with the vitreous humor, which most of it now is kind of here it oozed out on me and um, there's still a little bit in the anterior part we'll look at it but here's the this kind of brown part right here this one now when the slide out since that vitreous humor isn't there is the retina and it's not falling out all the way because the retina back here is attached to the optic nerve and so when we look on the, back here here's our optic nerve right here um, on the, and that's where the retina is attached to. that's why it's not sliding out all the way and then this black part right here is a um, choroid yeah choroid I mean and it has this kind of iridescent was the transudium luteum or something like that but it, this part would not be in humans that's the reflective part um, for animals so we would have the Choroid would be like this in the human eye. Um, okay, so that optic nerve feature seems to put this down for a second. I'm going to pick up the anterior cavity, which just seems to be sliding right. It still has a little bit of the vitreous humor, but right here we have the lens and um, more of the vitreous humor, but I kind of try to take this apart. So here we have the iris. And the pupil, and right here, I don't know if you can see, sorry, I'm trying to tilt it, but it's sliding, um, would be the aqueous humor. It's in front of the lens, whereas the vitreous humor is behind the lens. But you can see here the iris and then the pupil, where that would be. And here we have the lens, which normally would not be that hard, but because of the preservatives and stuff, but there's still a little bit of vitreous humor attached to the back of it here. And those are the parts of the eye, I believe I just talked about each one. Thank you.